Good Wednesday morning, lads. I'm Mary Sister Hill. And I'm Kieran Doolittle, and this is your KWHS News. Here's the latest news from our Counseling Center. Our first college visit of the semester kicks off today with CSU Fort Collins. Tomorrow, Western State Colorado University returns for a second visit. Mark your calendars for these February visits, starting with Pikes Peak Community College on February 7th, then Fort Hayes State on Tuesday, February 13th. Colorado Mesa will be here on Valentine's Day, and UCCS plans to be here on Thursday, February 15th. Plan your visit with Adams State on Thursday, February 22nd, and finally, Lamar Community College will close out February visits on Friday, February 23rd. Seniors interested in attending PPCC in the fall? Stop by the Counseling Center to sign up for PPCC's application day on Thursday, February 15th. PPCC reps will be here to help you fill out the application. They'll be back on Wednesday, April 11th to help you with registration. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, cosmetology classes are coming to Widefield High School next year. If you are interested, put your name on the list for more information by stopping at the Counseling Center. In senior news, Herf Jones will be in the lower commons during lunch today to help you with your orders. Remember, caps and gowns will be delivered the first week of May, but announcements will be delivered soon. If you ordered anything else, check with the rep today. Also, mark your calendars for the senior panoramic photo on Tuesday, February 6th at 7 a.m. in Bowers Gym. If you haven't picked up your senior class shirt yet, those are still available in the Counseling Center for $15. Get yours today and wear it for the senior picture. And remember seniors, if you want your photos included in the yearbook or the senior slideshow, send them to Curie Carmody at this email. Photos of, must be of seniors only. And finally, from the Counseling Center, juniors interested in attending the Career Start program at Pikes Peak Community College next year, the deadline to sign up to see Mr. Thiel is tomorrow. He only has limited slots, so so get yourself to the Counseling Center ASAP. Coming up, we're checking in with Miss Betsy and her guests for the lunch menu for today and tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. I have two new friends here to help me tell you what's on the menu. You ready? Today, meet Shepherd's Pie. Heute ist Bauer Auflauf Casserole. Oh, that sounds yummy. Mm. How about on Thursday? Meatball sandwich. And on Donnerstag gives Fleischerkugel sandwich. Thanks. We're, we'll see hey, you then. Hey, Have a great hey, one. Bye. bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. Students, if you need to add money to your lunch account, you can do it online or see Miss Betsy in the cafeteria. When we come back, we'll have club news, but first, we're throwing it to Daniel Robinson for our Gladiator Sports update. It's a great Wednesday morning, Glads. I'm Daniel Robinson with your Gladiator Sports Update. Winter sports are winding down their seasons and several spring sports are drumming up interest before practices start. Mark these meetings and, and contacts on your calendar if you are interested in participating. Ladies, if you missed the tennis meeting last week, check in with Mr. Washington in room 115 for more information. In case you missed it, Boys Swim and Dive held their informational meeting yesterday. Check in with Ms. Whitberg in room 110 for the details. Ladies, if soccer is your sport, today is your day. Mr. Dania is having a lady soccer meeting after school in room 130. See Ms. Dania if you cannot attend but are interested in playing. Baseball season is around the corner too. Guys interested in playing baseball? That meeting will be on January 29th at 7 p.m. in the WHS cafeteria. This meeting is for players and parents. The football team off-season workouts are underway. See Coach O in Bowers Gym for the schedule. And finally, if you're interested in track this year, see Coach Majerison in Bowers Gym for those details. In forensics news, the team is headed to Pueblo this coming Saturday for a we expect to have results on Monday. Good luck. Last night, our Lady Glads traveled south to Canyon City to take on the Tigers and easily added another W to improve their season record. The ladies are in fuego. Check them out on Thursday night against Sierra at Sierra at 7 p.m. Our men's basketball team also tangled with the Tigers on Tuesday and took the W. Our Glads are on the home court tomorrow night against the Stallions of Sierra. Surely our Glads can summon another win on Thursday night against the Stallions. We'll have scores for you on Friday. The wrestling team is at Canyon City tonight 
fight in a dual match. We're wishing our grapplers some good luck. In swimming news, the ladies jump in the Air Academy High School pool on Friday to race against the Rampart Rams. Just keep swimming, ladies. And finally, stay tuned on Friday for Doc's Health Tip of the Week. That's it for our sports update. Good luck to all our sports teams this week. Have a great Wednesday. I'm Daniel Robinson. Now back to you, Marissa and Kieran. Thanks, Daniel. Since we're in scheduling mode, there are several really great opportunities available next year. First, KWHS wants you. Applications are now available in room 102 if you would like to join our staff. See Miss Noop soon because applications are due next Friday, February 2nd. The yearbook also needs a few good staff members too. To join that crew, pick up an application from Miss Kennedy in room 104 ASAP. Those applications are due by next Wednesday, January 31st. Sophomores and juniors, the teacher cadet applications are available in room 202 for Miss Ship. Time is running out, so get your applications in quickly. If you're interested in the STEP program for next year, Miss Griggs is holding an informational meeting this Friday, January 26th at lunch in room 131. And finally, Renaissance applications are now available on the school wires page. Everyone is eligible to apply this time, including freshmen. All applications are due Wednesday, February 7th to Miss Sardinia in room 130, no later than 3 p.m. No late applications will be accepted. See Miss Sardinia for more information. Speaking of Miss Sardinia, she's having a meeting with the Power Club tomorrow at lunch in room 130. Just a reminder, Student Union is open again in the library every afternoon from 3 to 4.15. Be sure you have your sticker on your ID. Finally, students and teachers, golden tickets are coming soon. Teachers, remember to hand out your golden ticket to that one student among all your students who deserves it. Students, if you are the lucky re recipient of a golden ticket, remember to deposit it for a chance to win some very cool prizes. That's all for our news today. Have a great Wednesday. I'm Marissa Trujillo. And I'm Kieran Doolittle. And this was your KWHS News. Have a great day.